Hello everyone this is Dr Noor welcome to Optometry Reels in this session we are going to discuss about the what for dot is its application and importance in the clinical practice what for dot test is a clinical test which assesses the degree of binocular vision this sensory test is useful in detection of suppression diplopia anomalous retinal correspondence mainly seen in the conditions like amblyopia nic cornea strabismus and the nerve palsy to perform the test we require red green glass which is known as anaglyph you can also use red green filters which are present in the regular trial and set the other requirement is what for dot screen or the torch this screen or torch should contain four lights as shown on the screen make your patient wear red green glass and ensure that patient is fully corrected for the refractive error this test is performed in a dim room illumination ideally the red filter should be placed in front of the right eye and the green filter should be placed in front of the left eye ask your patient to look at the wafer dot torch or the screen and this test should be performed for the near as well as for the distance the wafer dot screen or torch contains four lights arranged in diamond shape on a black background these are one red two green and a white colored light on the screen when patient sees these four dots through the red filter it cut off the green light and only two dots will be seen similarly when you see these dots through the green filter it cuts off the red light and three green dots is seen here two dots of green and a white dot is visible as a green dots while performing the test you should ask series of questions in order to make correct diagnosis the result of both for dot test can be normal retinal correspondence when there is no strabismus and patient sees four dots accurately as one red two green and a mixed color light this condition is recorded as fusion present for the distance and the near please note that this test should be done for the distance as well as for the near even in the presence of strabismus four dots can be seen correctly as one red two green and a mixed color it is recorded as what for dot test fusion present for the distance or near with anomalous retinal correspondence whenever there is suppression of an eye patient will see only from one eye so when patient sees only two red light from the right eye then it is recorded as what for dot test two light or dot with left eye suppression please do not forget to specify the test distance as it can be tested for the distance as well as near similarly when patient sees only green light from the left eye then it shows right eye suppression and can be recorded as three lights or dots with right eye suppression in alternate strabismus patient may exhibit alternate suppression when each eye suppresses alternatively usually occurs when patient try to fix it with the right eye he will see the red dots when he fixates with the left eye will see the green dots in exotropia patient may see more than four dots and if they see two red and three green and if red is towards the left eye and the green is towards the right eye then it indicates cross diplopia and it is recorded as five dots cross diplopia exotropia in et or esotropia uncrossed diplopia will be seen and the patient will see five dots two red will be towards the right side and the three green dots will be towards the left side and it is recorded as what for dot test five dots uncrossed diplopia hope this was useful and informative like share and comment your views see you at the next video